New details in a man's daring attempt to get away from police. Good Thursday afternoon. I'm Karen Greer. A multi-county agency task force with police chase ends with an officer firing a shot and a suspect in police custody. CBS 46's Daniel Wilkerson's Where It All Ended near Covington Highway and Haynes Drive in Decatur. A chase that started in Newton County went through Rockdale, ending in DeKalb County. You can see the damage from the sign there in the distance. And then on the ground here is where that car came to a rest right after police performed a pit maneuver. Take a look at surveillance footage we shot when we got on the scene here at the top of your screen there. You can see the chase there as it was coming to an end in real time. It's hard to make it out there, but as it was coming to an end, the suspect hit several police cars. Here's a shot of the suspect there when it all ended. He's there in the ambulance. Here's a closer look at the vehicle police say he used. Now, as I said, this started in Newton County. Police there suspected the man wanted for aggravated assault. Apparently, he had no plans of stopping. The chase went from Newton County to Rockdale, ending here in DeKalb County, where officers again used that pit maneuver to stop the driver, but not before he hit several police cruisers. Now, we did confirm that at some point, once things came to a stop, an officer fired his weapon toward the man now in custody. He wasn't hit, no word on his condition. We spoke with this man who owns a business right in front of where it all ended. Some people just don't trust the police. I mean, there has to be more, more dialogue, more understanding that people have to know that the police is there to protect us. And the police has to show that more often. Police say no other suspects were involved. Of course, for the very latest on the investigation, just head to your free CBS 46 mobile app. In DeKalb County, Daniel Wilkerson, CBS 46 News.